What's up, machine? Another beautiful day. So, it's about 9 a.m., I believe. Powered on? Yes. Hold on. I have to record this landscape. Hold on. Okay. Landscape. Uh, check out all this fucking trash, dude. Hell of fucking garbage. Shameful. You ever see those homeless people who be walking around parking lots? You know, they got all the gear, all this shit on or whatever, and they're just like picking up garbage. Sometimes I think I'm going to turn into that guy because I find myself picking up garbage a lot. Uh, anyway, so. Oh, here comes the UPS truck. Don't want him to hit me. struggling to um, act with discipline and when it comes to money I've been actually doing pretty good with a lot of other things but when it comes to money man it's like I just don't even care I'll, I'll get a big bag you know I'll make a couple hundred bucks here and there and I'll just be like I'm good I don't care and it's crazy because it's like I got so much opportunity I got all the time in the world to make every dollar that there is, but what do I spend that time doing? So long story short, I'm broke and I don't want to go to work. And I remember that there is a bottle of water over here in this tree by Target. That somebody has left here since probably fucking 2013. No. You dirty, disgusting man. Stop it. Let's see. Come on, Rick. Oh my lord. What are you doing? Is this oh valid? What are you doing now? Don't think the seal's been broken. Nope. Bruh. This is clean water. And I'm taking it <laughs> because I can't afford it and I don't want to buy it. I wanted to record this moment in my life. Okay. <laughs> because, <laughs> because I need to remember one day when it's all said and done that I let myself stoop this low. Okay. So that's today's reminder to go a little harder today and keep me from being in this place at this time. Bye bye. Going inside of Target right now to use the bathroom and get my beautiful day started. Let's make the most of it. Plastic wedged in a tree for who knows how long. And who knows what for. But 
did it. They made it possible for somebody like me. Maybe it was their intention. It was because they knew that one day a very thirsty vagabond might be passing through and they could help them get just one step further. How do I not have any money, man? You know, I'm able-bodied. That's a huge privilege. I could, and I have a very, 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 very easy job that I can work at literally for 24 hours straight every single day, whenever I want. My problem is though, I can also not work there for fucking six months and not even call anybody and say anything about it. And nobody gives a shit. Because it's a fucking machine. You know? I need more ambition. That's all it is. But, how do you get that? Well, you know, I call all of my spikes of enthusiasm manic episodes but you know i don't think that i take enough time to really consider what preceded that manic episode because oftentimes what preceded that manic episode this is fucking upside down <laughs> what preceded that manic episode is fucking me doing things, you know, self-care, showering regularly, fucking getting haircuts and 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 shaving and fucking uh, exercising and, you know, eating right, eating something good or whatever, you know, uh, inspiring myself with, uh, uh, you know, movies and, and art and shit fucking drinking water even if you got to get it out of a tree <laughs> if this shit kills me whatever aged to perfection i'm telling you and i did in the target bathroom wash this water bottle because it was pretty dirty um just for like psychological reasons because the psychological and that's a good point because the psychological me the, the psychological means a lot man okay the things that affect you like you can't just be like oh okay i know that thing affects me so it's not gonna affect me anymore it continues to affect you regardless of whether or not you're aware of it if you are doing it you know for example having a fucking having a fucking sunshade up in your face when you could be soaking up some beautiful sun having you know a dirty car when you got two billion grocery bags in here that you could easily fill up with the trash that accumulates and leave it in the walmart fucking trash cans that are littered up and down the parking lot that you're allowed to fucking sleep in for whatever reason you know just you 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 really got to take care of yourself man and if you take care of yourself it your self takes back care of you that's kind of a dumb way to put it but you get that wave of energy that second wind you get that shit when you fucking care man when you when you try when you make an effort oh you silly man but anyway um got it This fucking thing. I got my boy. I'm going to start talking to that thing sometimes. <laughs> uh, I'm not going to give a really good reason for why. Because I'll be sitting here rambling forever. But. I'm just going to give him a chat. You know like the movie with the guy that was like lost on an island. And he was talking to, uh, to the volleyball. It healed him. And so will this guy. I forgot the name that I keep giving. I keep giving him names and I'm forgetting the name. Uh, but that's the video for today. If I ever even post it. And bye.
Bye-bye. See you later.